respect for each other. And here is an example. An all-out attack against the Iraqi government. A series of powerful explosions struck in central Baghdad. Two ministry buildings, the foreign and finance, were also targets. This is what is left of the foreign ministry after the attack. We were driving through and we didn't even know what was going on. We heard a huge explosion, as if a car had completely lifted up. This is a continuation of the, of the evil plans of uh, the people who are, uh, cannot see a stable free Iraq and uh, people with the intention of uh, keeping the American forces uh, in Iraq after the agreement uh, that was signed between the Iraqi government and the Americans to leave Iraq. Uh, I think this uh, escalation of violence in Iraq is totally unacceptable uh, since it is affecting the ordinary citizens. The violence comes exactly six years after one of the first major attacks in Iraq, after the toppling of Saddam Hussein. It's still too early to know the final death toll, but this is the first coordinated strikes in Baghdad since Iraqi forces took over responsibility for security in the city. Wednesday's attacks only highlight the large tasks they face in the weeks to come.